as accountants, I'm sure you know that we live in our offices and cubicles, so that is our natural habitat. It's, it's so funny how, especially in the office, how just a wall being up, and the wall is only you know, six feet tall, how it completely cuts you off. There's kind of two four packs right now, and the dynamics are a little bit different in both, but they're still kind of the place you want to be. So the four pack, um, it's just like open cubicles that are all together in a space. And so it used to be the six pack, there were six of us, three on each side. Now upstairs it was four and they're just all together. And so we just called it the, the four pack. I sit right outside a, a four pack and I call myself like a, a gopher sometimes because they'll be having conversation and I'll like pop my head up over and like chime in one sentence and then sit back down. <laughs> Working till noon? <laughs> what? Sarah always like pops her head over the window and wants to know what we're talking about. I sit in a four pack, but I'm There's not two in a four special packs. one. So the crazy one is is by yeah. the windows. Yeah. When we see any sort of glimpse of the outside world, we get a little bit more excited than the average person. Hey, being on the second story of an office building and we're surrounded by residential. Robert all of a sudden emails me and he says, you got to get over to the four pack right now. Um, this is, you know, something's going down. One of our neighbors in the front in the corner, he was digging with shovels and picks. And then literally like an hour later, we saw this big piece of machinery just came in and just, you know, he called in the artillery. We were taking bets on it yesterday. So all of a sudden, out of nowhere, he shows up in a backhoe. He puts out one tiny little orange cone Everyone that walked by, we were all like pressed up against the window watching this because we thought he was going to hit the fire hydrant. Yeah, we have no idea what he's doing. And we were actually just waiting for that big machine for the guy that was driving it to just, you know, go through the fire hydrant and just that thing was going to be exploding pretty soon. Okay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't understand the rocks. It's just a yard with dirt and rocks. Yes, this is pretty much daily life here. <laughs> <laughs> What's the point of having the back home? <laughs> Very good question. Very good question. <laughs>